you're welcome, my friends. Sir. What's going on? Why is everyone at the graveyard? Um, everyone has gone to Adana's castle to celebrate the decade of her reign. Wait, <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Come clear on this. Me like father, mother, everybody, the whole royal household went to honor Adani on my day of return. Yes, my prince. Actually, I was left behind so that I can bring you there. My prince, let's go. Where's my son? Your Highness, he declared coming with me. What? Why? Greetings, brother. Brother, what is the problem? Well, father wants to see you. Business deprived you witnessing the never seen drama that happened in Adanis Castle. Hey, baby, if not business, what else? My friend, you missed. Hi, I wished you were there. Oh, this ceremony was the highest that I've ever seen. Don't tell me you missed it now, eh? Mm -hmm. Don't tell me. Sorry to disappoint you, but I missed it. Yes, I missed it. With the ceremony put food on my table this week, you choose. Business or ceremony, which is better? As you can see, me, I have chosen business. So I have chosen business because today happens to be one of my luckiest days. Hey, I am so happy I made the decision not to attend that ceremony. If not, the world will be regretting. Chinatu, I think you are a Luna. You like to deprive yourself of things that lifts your spirits and makes you happy. Hey, Bobby. The only thing that can make me happy right now is more money to take care of all my needs and wants. That's all. Your life, your choice. Thank mm. God you know. By the way, 
You mean you made all this money today? Including this one, one thousand? Mm -mm. Abacha. Achaba. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I'll join this business, so... <laughs> <laughs> no problem. There's space for you. You will teach me now. Eh, uh, but you'll pay me. I'll pay you after all this money that I'm because, saying. Because I told you, you like money. Today happens to be my luckiest day. Look at And you want me to attend ceremony. What could be his reason for not attending the ceremony? Hmm. Let's wait. Till he comes and explains. Then we will know his reasons. What took you so long? He refused to talk to me. He didn't talk to you? Yes, mother. I even stood there for a while. I was talking to him, but he pretended as if he's not hearing me. But he did. It's okay. Oh. Uh. I will speak to him myself, and I'll know his reasons. Son? Son, what is the problem? Do not keep mute like you do not see me. You refuse coming down to honor my call. I climbed the stair and I'm here. You're still silent. AGK, do not take your father the king for an idiot. You drove up the hills of Ifitani to honor the ceremony of a woman whom you deem much more important than your own son you haven't seen for a while who has been abroad for eight years on his day of return. So, Father, climbing just a few staircases wouldn't be that much of a sacrifice, would it? What are you doing? But it's all wrong. We couldn't have missed the ceremony either. You know, 
Sometimes we do wrong trying to do the right things. And that is when proper apologies come in. He knows the position of Adani in Iftar. As the next traditional ruler of Ifitani, he should be able to understand because in the future he will find himself in some kind of situation. Maybe he doesn't. And that is where proper explanations come in. He has every right to be displeased if he's not properly treated. No one likes to be disappointed. You're right, my queen. Let's allow him some rest. I'll speak to him tomorrow. Thank you, my king. I mean, can you imagine? No, seriously, can, can, can you just imagine the disgrace? How lowly placed I was? I mean, can, 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 can you just imagine the mockery? You know what? You know what? Um, I'll hold back. Son, I want to talk to you. I'll be fine here, I'll be fine here, I'll be fine, I'll see you. How much is the plate of Abacha? Again, as usual, 300 with fish, 250. Hey, give me the one with fish, give me the one with fish. Oh, this is what I put for you. I tried. You want onion? Eh, put onion, put onion. Small, small. Small, small onions. And fish. And one fish. That one way big a hair. Thank you very much. Thank you. I can give you clean money. Ooh, ooh. No. Thank you. Thank you. We'll go see tomorrow.
It's been a while, sir. I just want you to feel the, the naturality of the environment once again. Well, in my own opinion, nothing has changed. Yes, even the tradition. Only that when you miss them for some time, it gives a special kind of feeling and understanding. And what part of the tradition are we talking about here? The type and a kind that will make you abandon your sounds return, just like I did yesterday. Well, when I'm king, even before I become king, I will never disrespect my son in such manner. I pray you don't find yourself in such a situation. I know that's never going to happen. Because I don't know what ceremony will make me ignore the arrival of my own son. Adani is the number one indigen in Ifitani and the most honored woman. Did I hear you right? Oh, yes. Wait, 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 father. Hold on. <laughs> Don't tell me that you were actually summoned with the royal household. I said everybody, including yourself, to Adani's. The tradition made it a mandatory that we all needed to be there. For what? For what? When you get there, you will know. Shall we? Yes, Papa. I know you have been asking me about Adani. Yes, Papa, tell me. <laughs> you see, Adani position is one that is occupied by somebody from the blue blood lineage. Once in every two centuries. Blue blood. Yes. What are the requirements to pick Adani, Papa? <laughs> well, we have the blue blood lineage of Ifitani. The Ezemo will choose the chosen one from that lineage through the directive of the gods. And when the person is chosen, she weighs so much power and authority that the king is answerable to her. But this whole thing is confusing. From books that I've read, Kings are the most important in their land. Why is our own different? You are right, my daughter. Igbo culture and tradition is the same, but just with a slight difference, just like in our own case. The truth of the matter is that <clears throat> the Adani position is a very powerful one. Do you know that when Adani is chosen, she performs the New Year festival? Hmm? Yes. The Ezemo takes order from her. And the king must visit her castle to seek her consent in any decision he wants to take about the kingdom. Papa, that, that's limiting his supremacy. You are right, my dear. You are right. But ours is like a monarch system. Like, just like the British, where the queen is supreme. Adan enjoys more supremacy. Papa, you, you said something about blue blood. Please, what is blue blood? <laughs> My daughter, there is more to the existence of Adani, which I might not give you all the details now. <laughs> Don't worry, go and get my food. Yeah? <laughs> okay, Papa. All right. So, that is it. And that is nonsense. That is rubbish. With due respect, Father, whoever made that statement has made a nuisance of a statement. Rubbish! 
You're being insulted. Son. I have told you this story over and over again for years. Why acting as if this is the first time of hearing it? Because I have grown to realize what a true insult is. Father, open your eyes. You are being insulted. Your throne is being insulted. Look down upon. It means nothing worth even more than tissue paper. What are we talking about here? We are royalty. And we must enjoy supreme power. I say it again. Supreme power in this land. Not one woman who sits on a useless throne as a dali. Mind your words. We are outside. And of course you know the walls have ears. Well, I don't care. I don't care. Let them hear. I don't care. Father, now is your reign. But one day, I will rule Ifitani as king and as supreme leader, supreme ruler, supreme and sole custodian of our culture and tradition, not one woman or one throne. You will have the gods to contend with. Well, they will hear. They will hear from me. They will hear my reasons. Because if they didn't want a king, they should have made it clear from the onset. Not bringing people to sit on one throne and look like mannequins that can talk. My son, this is an age-long tradition established by our forefathers, our ancestors, and you cannot fight against it. Let's wait till I'm king. Then, the gods and this palace will see. Agali, the gods of justice and tranquility. The gods that see beyond human imagination. You have never failed your people. Whatever we request, Agali, you are there to fulfill it to us. And we adore you. You have been the gods of our forefathers. And we can never leave you. What we seek is what we get from you. We are happy that you are there. I apologize if I interrupt the communication between the gods and its mouthpiece. You came just like the gods directed. I anticipate your visit. May they live long and ageless. Just like they are from the beginning. A cock does not run in the daylight in vain. What do I owe this visit? Uh, she demands your presence now. I shall arrive before she bats an eyelid. I will deliver as you said. May the party go be submissive, just like the one you came from. You see. As you said, so shall it be done. Come in. Greetings, my friends. Yes, greetings. Much is said. I'll be out in a bit. Thank you, my friends. It's not to like the food. Not really. Why? Is it not tasty? No, it's not. It's not. I mean, it's it's, it's not bad. It's nice, you know. But uh, um, this is not actually what I would have loved to eat. So, what do you want to eat? You know, I've had too much rice. 
understand? I've had too much rice abroad. I would have loved, you know, something, you know, something closer to home. You know, something much more traditional. Not rice. Only have a time that blows both the rich and the poor. Yes, because the rich and the poor enjoys the reign of time. Um, I don't understand. Is it that the meal is not delicious or what? What happened? For me, the food was okay. But he said he doesn't want to eat rice any longer. He needs something local. Something local like, uh, uh, was he specific on particular food or something? He did not, but I guess he wants something like um, roasted yam, bush meat, roasted plantain, palm wine. That wouldn't be a problem. <laughs> Greetings, Your Highness. Oh, greetings, Onyama. Oh, what is it? Your Highness, Ezedibia is here to see you. Ezedibia? Oh, okay. Let him wait at the throne room. He said he doesn't want to come inside. Doesn't want to come in? Okay. I'll build him. I'll see. Ezedibia, why have you refused to come in? Because the gods are angry. What could be the reason? Has anybody committed any atrocity or abomination that could anger the gods? The royal family. Royal family? What has the royal family done that could anger the gods? When a child refuses to answer his or her call and goes into hiding, then something is wrong. He who is being admired doesn't need to wear rags. Who is this admirable man in this royal family that is Adonan or Rag? The prince. My son? Yes. What has he done? The question should be, what has it he done? This is the I'm kind of confused. I better take my leave. When a man refuses to hear the cry of a child seeking for help, then that man is heartless. I mean no harm. Why are you following me like a fly? Because I need the attention. Okay, you have it. What do you want to say? 
My name is Ebuko Nyema. Mm. Don't worry. The next time I see you, I will make sure I call you by your name. Can I go now? What about you? Don't you have a name? I don't have a name. <laughs> you know that is not possible. My brother, anywhere you see me, call me when I abacha. I'll answer you. Oh? But what's the problem? What did he say? The gods are angry because you are yet to fulfill the necessary obligation, which is a visit to Adani for your blessings since you return to the kingdom. Over my dead body. Did you say over your dead body? Yes, father, you heard me over my dead body. I am royalty. I don't know who she is. If there's anybody who should be visiting anybody, she should be visiting me, not the other way around. Does she have a name? Who is she? My son, she is Adani, also from the lineage of Blue Blood. And I am Prince AGK, the next king of Ifite Ani. And I will not bow down before any female creature. Father, if you have disgraced reduced, disrespected your office by bowing down to her, count your son out. Hmm. <clears throat> My son, please do not start something you cannot finish. One thing you fail to realize about me, father, is I'm a train that doesn't know how to stop. When I want something, I never get tired. And this next king called AGK has his brain in between his ears. AGK. AGK. I was fortunate to see him the other day. I swear with my womb, this young man is handsome and charming. <laughs> really, I'm telling you, immediately I set my eyes on him. I couldn't help but imagine myself in his arms. <sighs> Wonderful imagination. <clears throat> now, come back into reality before you fall into the bush. And what is that supposed to mean? Hey, Bobby, you better cut your coat according to your size. The making impossible wishes. You think I am not worthy to have the prince, right? <clears throat> well, Miss Wisha, I've always known you to be jealous. Mother, I think I stand with Ejike. Do you really know what you stand for? The truth. The truth everyone is scared to say. Good. My dear child. Have you taken time out to know why people are not talking about it? <laughs> Probably for their interest. It's time someone speaks out. And the only person that will do that is the person it affects, being us. Let me educate you, my child. Okay. People are not talking about it because nobody wants to be in war with the gods. But nobody is fighting the gods. He's just trying to right the wrong happening in this land. Well, since you have the privilege, stop him from taking the step he wants to go into. Everyone who did in the past did not have a happy ending. It is not going to end well. <laughs> Mother, I think it's time for someone to give it a try. And that's what he's trying to do.
My prince, you sent for me. Oh, yes. Um, please, is there anywhere you can get me African salad? Well, I, I am sure I can get that at uh, Afro Market. Good. You go to my room in the drawer by the right. There's some money there. Take some of it and get it for me, please. Kindly ignore every single dollar note you see there. Thank you. Okay, my prince. Thank you. Greetings, Your Majesty. Welcome, my queen. I just said you sent for me. Yes, I did. Okay. It is about your son. <sighs> His refusal to pay homage to Adani, right? Yes. Please. I want you to speak to him. He needs to do the needful so he doesn't attract the wrath of the gods. I have spoken to him, but he remained obstinate about it. I have to. Oh, you did? Yes, my king. But from his response, I don't think he will ever give in. Why has this boy made up his mind to bring calamity to this family and the entire kingdom? Um, 
Let me get the maids to serve it at the dining. No, 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 please, please bring it here. African food is best served the African way from source. Please, please, please. Uh, no, 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 hot as it's supposed to be. What is right, what is wrong? The king should be below. When a child decides to know what he is father, he becomes a victim of what he is father. We are not Yes. When a child wants to know what killed his father, automatically he becomes the victim of what killed his father. Greetings, says the Dibia. Mr. Dibia will greet you. Greetings, elders of Ifitani. He whose house is on fire doesn't go after that. Is it Dibia? Can you please come clear so that we can decode your meaning? Let us understand what you're saying. Exactly. Is only a foolish man after eating to his satisfaction challenges his chi in a battle. Tell the king that time is of essence. Before the anger of Adani, I works the anger of the gods of Ifitani. The rain that is about to fall is not the same rain that you use umbrella as shelter. And when it falls, tell him Ifitani will be wiped out. What is he talking about? I don't know. Both of us are just hearing the message for the first time. Maybe you should tell the king he says that words. Maybe the king will understand. In that case, let me go back and see the king immediately before going home. I think that's the right thing to do. Aye. You said time is of essence. Time is of essence. Gawana, people. Time. What's up? Time. I'm back now. Time. Time. Chinatu 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 Bye Prince Mm. I hope you are enjoying the African salad. You know what? Seriously, I'm underwhelmed, you know. The hype you gave this African salad was just way over the top. I know I've tasted better. You no, know, I'm eating it because... You know, I miss it, but I know there's something missing. There's something missing. That means this one is not good. Like I said, there's something just missing in the taste. Something. <laughs> My prince. African salad is unique. One of the things that made it so is the difference in taste. Which depends on the person that prepared it. Yeah. But, uh, don't worry, I will try and get it from another person next time. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Yeah, you know what? Um, you can have it. Mm -hmm. You can have it. Uh, I'm sorry, my friends. Yeah, it's okay. Enjoy. I'll try and get better one next yeah, time. Enjoy yourself. It's okay. All right. Thank you, my friends. Yes, please get from. A better source next time, huh? Uh, my yeah, better source. He said time is of essence. You also mentioned the wrath of Adani and the gods. Oh no. Majesty. The prince has refused to pay homage to Adani as the gods demand. Why? What is his reason? A stupid one. He actually said that it is Adani that will pay homage to him for being a royalty. Is he out of his senses? 
The same question I asked. Didn't you explain the sanctity of Adani in Ifitani to him? You know who I did. But all fell on a deaf ear. The prince is playing with fire. What are you doing here? You are back. Mm -mm. I'm not back. What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I was market today. You have not answered my question. What are you doing here? Chinato, I'm here to see you. What for? Can you just give me a listening ear? How long have you been here? Over an hour now. Fine. I am listening. What do you want? Why do you hate me with so much passion? God forbid I hate my fellow human who has done nothing to me. Then why are you avoiding me? Because you are disturbing me. Okay. I'm sorry if that's the way you see it. But I don't mean any harm. I mean well for you. What is it? Ibuka, what do you want from me? Chinati, I want you. Yes, I love you. Can't you see it? You see, my prince, tradition has willed so much past to her. But that doesn't concern me. I have no business with that. Not at all. If tradition has willed her so much power, then let her rule over the tradition and custom of the people who say so, except my very self. And of course, some wise people. Yes. I know what royalty is. I understand it and I've read books on it too. Listen. A king is to be the sole custodian of custom and culture. I'll say it again. A king is to be the sole custodian of culture and tradition of his people. Not the other way around. So I don't care whatever power that has been willed to her. I don't care. It has nothing to do with me. Meaningless to me. You see, my prince, you don't understand. Her anger spits like burning fire. Burning fire. And in fact, your decision might bring down the wrath of the gods upon this country. Now I'm waiting for the wrath. Let the wrath come. I'm waiting. <gasps> My prince. Yes. He who lives in glass house should not throw stones. Do not throw stones, please. Oh no. Yeah. That depends on the direction the stones are being thrown. Wake up. The king sent me. To do what? To apologize for... Oh, no, Wu! If the king wants to apologize, he should do that himself. He knows about this, but... Leave.
I understand your agitation. And I stand by you. But... No buts, please. No buts here. No buts. There has to be. How do you expect everyone to follow a path you woke up with? You have to convince them why they should. What other conviction do they need? I'm telling you, what other conviction do they need? Knowing that their tradition has unnecessarily willed too much power to that woman, making our father a mockery, the king a mockery. Our father is supposed to be the supreme leader, the supreme custodian of our culture and our people's tradition, not the other way around. If you do not know this, the royal household has become nothing. It has become ordinary. It has become silly. It has become nothing but more than tissue paper. Well, I'm not here to talk you out from your decisions. Just that you need to understand what you want to put this family into. I am waiting for the wrath of the gods to come. Unlike all of you, all of you, I refuse to be manipulated. Never will I be manipulated. Never. AG. You heard me. Did you thoroughly explain to her my reasons? She would not even let me speak. She insisted I deliver to you exactly what she said to me. That's so inhuman. How could she be so inconsiderate? Your Majesty, do you not speak evil of Adani? It is a taboo, remember? Um, I uh, will take my leave now. Please, take a drink. Uh, thank you, Your Majesty. Uh, maybe next time. Your Majesty. So is right, so is right. The king should be supreme. And leave a bow to any woman. Oi, what is right, what is wrong? How I so wish these things can be amended. Don't tell me to calm down. Don't tell me to calm down when things are getting from bad to worse. Well, there's nothing you can do about it. Oh, there's so much I can do, Mother. So much. That will not bring calamity upon this land. I have been saying this. I've been shouting, I've been complaining, but nobody dares to listen. Nobody. Now, have we seen it? Have we all seen it? A tradition father protects now turns around to make him a mockery. How can? Now, can you imagine a subject, a subject, Adani, sends for father and says, Father, the king should come personally to apologize to her. Where does that happen? Where? No, no, tell me where. Now, do you even know if that woman hasn't told father to kiss her feet and call her queen? You're looking at me? Okay. Furthermore, that woman and father consults personally and privately. Do you know what has been happening? Do you know? Food for thought. You know he's a boy. Old enough to be a king. I know. I know, but please, bad on him. Give him more time. Please. Extend your period of grace. Please. Why should I show mercy to a boy who has shown me nothing but disrespect? He has not. He's only controlled by his youthful exuberance. Tell him to do the needful. You should do the needful. Else, this land 
will feel the rot of Adan. Tell me you are coming. Am I restricted from visiting my woman? I did not say so. Just that it's time for my business and I may not have time to discuss with you. Okay. Unfortunately, I did not come here to discuss with you. Why are you here then? To assist you. So. Greetings, my friends. Greetings. If it's not Chibuese, madam. <laughs> you are right. You are right. Please sit down. Thank you. Ah, it's been a while. Yes, actually, I, I traveled out of the country. And when I came in, I was informed you were in town. Ah, you did well. You did well. You did well. <laughs> so, uh, what brings you to the palace? Well, um, I, I came to see your sister, the princess. You came to see my sister. Yes. <laughs> my sister. <laughs> I smell doom. I smell calamity. I smell the wrath of our benevolent gods. Aging closer. Closer. I know you scare me. And our prince is here to pay homage to the Adan. He is not in a hurry to change his mind. Hey. That is the problem. Hey. And what have Adani decided? 
she is threatening the peace of the land. The very peace of the land. Hey. I know. This is the time we elders have to come into this matter. We cannot fold our hands and what things go wrong. So, what do we do? If I suggest we have a meeting among ourselves. Without involving the king. And take a decision. We must do something for the interests of this kingdom. I think that is a very good idea. I think you are right. Yes, that's a very good idea. Very good idea. Um, I want a full package eh? with uh, fish, pomo, oba. Okay. Then you add it uh, otaze. Onions. Yes, okay. yes. Just please mix it very well, and I want it to be no, tasty. No problem. It's sir. for the prince. Hey, no problem, sir. You will like it. You will like it very much. Give me this one for you. Yes, yes. You can add extra for more no and fish, please. No problem. Are you blocking me? 
You are very stupid. You are very stupid for referring to me as your son. Can you give me to a man like me? Can I be your son? We can be your son. Can I be your son? Me. Since we started driving, you've not said anything. Please. <sighs> Baby, please, your silence is killing me. You know, you know, you know how I value hearing your voice. Please talk to me. Pick on me. Chi. Jim. My love. No, oh my, oh my eyes is seeing me. Oh, eh? What kind of thing is this? Why did the priest dash my horse to the wall? Yeah? I was thinking he would remain like before. Instead, he finished everything. He even licked the flask. Yeah? Ah ah. Tazu, tauguazu. Yeah? And I even sent myself on errand of come and pick, uh, uh, pick the flask. <coughs> but I'm not doing it again. The, the meds will come and pick it. Baby, talk to me. What did I do wrong? You really don't know what you've done wrong. I don't know and that is why I keep asking you. Listen, some of the things I hate so much is pride and disrespect. And you have both. Look, I'm sorry to say this, so, but you see this relationship. I see it heading nowhere. Okay? But, but, baby, see. Wait for what? Please. I can, I can always change. Wait, why are you even angry? <laughs> for you. All is well. Hmm. If you see another woman with your man, Ebuka, well, if you see it as all is well, then all is well. I don't understand what you're talking about. Wait. I saw Ebuka and Chinatu in his car. How do I even say this? Kissing. Romancing. Some things that I can I don't, I don't even know how to mention them. You need to see. No. Just tell me you are joking. Wait, oh. I'm telling you what I saw with my two eyes. You are walking away. Wait, oh. that's not so. <laughs> that idiot with my man. I am telling you the truth. I can't do your prefer in the month of November now. I'm telling you what I saw. Okay, no problem. Let me get some first. Let me plan myself very well. I will teach that girl a very big lesson. But wait, oh, please. Don't tell her it said so. Please, don't even mention my name. But what I know is, I saw both of them with my two naked eyes. No problem. Don't tell her I I'll said so. Myself, I'll teach her. Remember, don't tell her I said so. Hey, thank you. I will teach her. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. 
Wherever you bought this from, huh? Don't stop buying from there. Buy from that same source. God! Oh. My prince, I can see you really enjoyed today's old. No, 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 no. I did, I did, I did, I did. Ah, no, no, no. This made me miss this village a whole lot more. Oh! Oh! Well. Ah, no, no. You emptied the flask. <laughs> you didn't even remain anything for me. No, no. This time around, I choose to be very selfish. Thank you. I even wanted more, you know. <laughs> Don't worry. I will make sure I buy from the same person every day. Good, good, good. Even tomorrow. Uh, my prince, mm. do you need any other thing? Like what? When I get to that part, I'll let you know, okay? Okay, my prince. Okay. Mm. Chinatu, why keep me aside for so long? I've been knocking for a while what now. What do you want? What do you mean, what do I want? What do you want? Why are you here? <sighs> Chinatu, we are lovers, aren't we? Before. How do you mean before? Listen, Ibuka. I need time. I really need time to think about this whole thing. So I advise that you let me be. She had to see. Please, 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 just go. Oh, my princess. Come here. So, will you say you're taking me to somewhere nice? Oh. Somewhere you would like. Wow. <laughs> and um, I have a surprise for you today. Surprise? <laughs> you know I love surprises. Yes, and that is why I want to give you one. <laughs> so, um, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so this is true. Eh? Madness. No problem. You've not seen anything yet. When you will see the real madness is when I will see you near my fiancé again. Um, please. Who is this fiancé of yours you think I would want to associate with? Okay. You don't know who is my fiancé again, Abby. Okay. Now, swear with your dead parents that you killed that you don't know that Ebuka is my fiancé and we've been together for a long time now. Did you just say I killed my parents? Yes, I did. Am I lying? Answer me! Am I lying? I don't care with this your crocodile tears though. What I know is this. I don't want to see you near my fiancé again. I will not warn you again. You are crying. So crying. Just excited. This is fulfillment of dream. Share it with me. Ta -da. Uh, <laughs> you got engaged? Yes, mom. Really? Let me see. Come here. <laughs> wow, this is good news. I'm so proud of you. Thank you, mom. He proposed and I said yes. I'm happy for you. <laughs> oh. Mm, congratulations. Thank you. That's quite a celebration. I know. So let me get some drink. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> Wait. Thank God I met you. What is it? Is there a problem? A very big one. Which is? Tell that thing you call your friend. Tina, or whatever that she's called. Tell her to leave my man alone. Because anytime I see the two of them together, this community will not contain she and I. Are you indirectly telling me that Tina is going after your man? I am not indirectly telling you. I am directly telling you that she is. And I will not spare her the next time I see her around my man. Just warn her. This whole thing is a bit surprising to me because Chinat is not the type that goes after people's man. Oh. Are you sure about what you're saying? I wasn't told. I saw her myself. <sighs> no, I'll ask her. We just want her. Oh, just want her. You better want her. She said you killed your parents. How could she say something like that to you? Doesn't she know how your parents died? Mr. Why you're crying? I guess she said that to hurt me. And she has succeeded. It's fine. But tell me the truth. Are you going after Ibuka? No. I never did. Ebuka was the one who approached me for a relationship. I declined initially, but I later changed my mind. I, I never knew he had a girlfriend and he didn't tell me to. I believe you. I believe you. But you need to let him go. You need to let Ebuka go so you don't ruin your reputation. I don't want Ozioma ruining it for you. I heard you. How's it go? Oh. Stop crying now. Good day, no. Ah, chief guy. How are you? I'm fine. I'm just coming from your house. Your wife told me you went for a dance meeting at the village square. 
Yes, as a matter of fact, we have just dismissed from the meeting. Okay. Um, oh no, the king wants to see you. The king wants to see me? Yes. Okay. Mm, I'll be at the palace later. Mm? Tell the king I'll be there later. Mm? Let me get to my house first. Mm? Okay. Don't pretend as if you do not see me because I know you do. Ebuka, Ebuka, carry your useless self from my compound. I don't want to ever see you again. Chinatu, what wrong have I done again? Why all this insult and attitude? Go and ask your girlfriend, Ozioma. Who came here to insult me? Listen, Ebuka, I beg you. I don't want to be a topic in the mouth of gossips in this village. So get out from my compound. I don't want problem. Go! Wait, you mean Ozioma came here to warn you? You heard me! Mba, leave. Okay, Chinat, Mba. Get, get out. See. Get out. Leave. I'll use this broom to hit you. Go. I don't want to insult you. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'll go. Get out. You have a girlfriend and you're coming here to disturb me. So, who's your mother? Ah, oh no, greetings. Uh, Oyema. Oyema. Come. My friends. Yes, uh, it's a beautiful day and uh, like to take a walk. Okay, my prince. Uh, do you want to go with the car or? Like I said, I want to take a walk, starting from here. Come with me. Okay, my prince. Your Majesty, uh, you sent for me. Yes. The princess is getting married. The father to her suitor was here today. And that is why I sent for you as the tradition demands. I'm sorry, Your Majesty. Uh, we, the elders of Ifitani, will not be present in any ceremony within the palace. Oh no, why? As a matter of fact, uh, Your Majesty, I was on my way from the meeting of elders when I met Onyema. At that meeting, we, we resolved that until the prince does the needful with the elders in council, we buy cut every activity in the palace. Oh no. Oh no, are you not planning coup against my reign? Your Majesty, call it whatever you like, but it is all for the good of Ifitani. I will take my leave now, and this might be my last visit to the palace until the prince pays homage to Adani. You will.
Greetings, my friends. Yes. Greetings, beautiful maidens of our land. Greetings, my friends. Greetings, beautiful one. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, 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 good. Wow. You know, our maidens are quite well-mannered and beautiful as well. Of course, my friends. Yes. We are blessed. We are blessed. I know. Th that is why men from far and near visit our community to pick wives. Yes, 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 yes. yes. You know, we're very well-mannered, you know, I must say. Uh, of course, my prince. Yes, yes, they are. Were you deaf? The priest called me beautiful. And so? Everybody and so? How does that affect a change in your life? Kill the jealousy and read the handwriting on the wall. The prince loves me already, I think. Hmm. And thank God you just ended it with, I think. Because that was never true. The prince I know will not leave the daughters of the king. Governors and senators and settle for a nobody like you. Don't insult me. Hey, Bubi, I am not insulting you. I am not. But you just called me a nobody. I am not insulting you. But, hey, Bubi, are you not a nobody? I don't blame you. done again what has he done right since he returned is it about the visit to Adani my queen the elders have vowed not to step into this palace until he visits Adani wow that's too harsh why would they say a thing like that do not blame the elders. They are doing what they have to do. Your son is the only problem here. You're welcome. Why did you refuse to come in? Why did you approach Nathan? Why won't I approach her? Because she is not your business. Whoever that wants to take you away from me is my business. That is not your decision to make, but mine. No, it is not yours. It is ours. <laughs> Ozioma, you must be out of your senses. Maybe. Ozioma, I've warned you. 
Stay away from Chinato. I will not warn you again. This is my last warning to you. Those I do not warn you. Get out from my car. Huh? Get out from my car. Like you are get out of my car! Tell me get out of my car! Ask me. Get out of my car! Shut my door! Your decision is becoming disastrous to the entire kingdom. Father, if it's about me not visiting Adani, please, I don't want to talk about you it. You have to talk about it. You really have to. Especially now that it's becoming a hindrance for your sister to get married. I don't understand. Of course. How does my not visiting Adani affect my sister's marriage? The elders have taken decision to boycott whatever activities taking place in this palace. And you know what that means? Nobody will come. You think you can run? Abby? Uzuma. You think you can run? Uzuma, I don't know what you're talking about. After all my warning, after all my warning, all you think you can do is to go and tell Ebika to break up with me so that he can be with you. Abby? Uzuma, I don't have strength for your problem. I don't know what you're talking about, so just <laughs> let me go. Easy, go where? You think I'm as jobless as you? Oh. As you can see, I am going to the market. Okay. Uzioma, you are jobless. <laughs> it sounds very interesting. Okay. No problem. We can go. Uzioma! She said I'm jobless. Uzioma, this is... You want to go? Go to the market. This is just the beginning. By the time I am done with you in this village, you will know that you have stepped on the tiger's tail. This is just the beginning. Go to the market. Go to the market.
The prince is the ideal man for me. I think he admires me. What can I do to win his heart? What can I do to get him love me? Should I be bold and approach him? Would he look down on me because I am not royalty or belong to the high class? Are you alright? Yes, Papa, I'm fine. Come and give me a word. Thank you, Papa. Ichike, if not for anything, for my sake, please do it for me. Hey, can you just stop it? Stop it, please. Stop! I'll pay no homage to no one, and that is my stand. Even when it affects me, I thought you loved me. Of course I do. I do. I do so much. And trust me when I say I do. I do. I really do. You don't. You don't. All you care is your pride and your ego. Listen, what I care about is this family. I care about the status of this family. We are royals. We are the royal family. Understand that every time we are the royal family. And let me tell you this, our family holds the traditional stool of Yiftani, yet we are subjected to ridicule. We are made inferior by the tradition of Yiftani. For what? GK, please, just this once. It won't kill you. Please do it for me so I can get married. If we must fight for justice, we must fight for it now. And not care about who it affects now or today. We must fight for it now and focus on what it tends to bring in the future. That should be our focus. That should be our focus. Think about it. Look at it. me. I'm a woman. Time passes. I'm not getting any younger. She told me what you did to her yesterday. Are you here to fight me? No, but to tell you the truth. Let her be. She has ended whatever relationship she had with Ebuka. <laughs> Are you sure she has? I won't be here if I am not sure. The next time you attack her again, I'll fight you. Oh, I'm scared. Is that a threat? Mm. It's a promise. Bye. <laughs> So, um, what did he say? He refused to listen to anybody. I guess you should talk to him. He might listen to you. He refused to listen to everybody, including your father, the king. Yes. The queen, and you too. So, what made you think me talking to him would make any difference? Because he's your friend. There is no harm in trying. Just talk to him. What is it? Please. I'm sorry for the last time. I know I overreacted. Please, forgive me, please. And I can't remember demanding for apologies from you. I know. I was even coming to your house so that we can talk. Okay, you're coming to my house. Okay. It's okay, there's no problem. Go to my house. Sit and wait for me till the next time I'll come to this village, then we can see. Are you leaving for the city already? Do you have any problem with that? No, oh, yes. What about our marriage plans? Come on, get out of here. I'm going to go to my marriage. You are here. Ebuka, please, don't do this to me now. Please, wait. Please. Ebuka, please, now, please. My prince, if you ask me, I will. Hey, I'll say, save your breath, okay? Save your breath. I will not go to visit Adani. For any reason, I will not go there. If there's anybody to visit anybody, she should come here and visit me. That's the way it should be. I will not go there even in 
death. Even if the gods, one of them comes down here, or two of them come down here to solicit on our behalf, I will not go there. Let me ask you a question. Why do you hate her so much? You knew that this tradition has been in existence for a long time. So why? That is because I now realize her supposed supremacy over the royal family. Can you imagine? I came back from abroad and I didn't meet not even one single member of the royal family to welcome me. That was the height of it. That was the height. Well, that's, that's quite bad though. But then, this tradition has been too so long for you to start agitating for a change now. I mean, the past kings, queens, prince and princesses allowed it so. Why don't you? My name is Prince AGK. I have a good head with a good brain in it. I've taken my stand and my stand is final. Are you aware that this stand of yours is going to affect my marriage with your sister? Uh, please make it as delicious as the other day. Ah, uh, trust me now. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed it. Oh, of course he did. Uh, he mandated me to always buy from you. Ah, thank you so much. You see, thank you. Yeah, put uh, fish. I'll yeah, put. Thank you. I should be the one to thank you. <laughs> mm. It's not a problem. Yeah, sir. but is good. Yeah, thank but, you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, sir. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I guess. Sorry, sorry. My, my, I understand. Me, I understand. Me. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you. My prince. No. You called me. Yeah, ma. I did. Wait to ask you though. Um, this African salad. Did you buy it from the same place you bought from the other time? Hmm? Yes, my prince. No wonder. No wonder. Well, tell me, how much will it cost for you to negotiate with whoever it is to bring this to the palace every day? In large quantities though. My prince. Mm. I don't know. Maybe I should invite her so that I can negotiate with her yourself. No, a pleasure. Go, go, go. Bring her here. Bring her here this evening. Uh, yeah. That wouldn't be possible today, my prince. Mm. She might have gone. Okay, then you invite over tomorrow, okay? I'm sure I will. All right, all right. Okay, okay. Uh, one more thing, my prince. What? Uh, please. No. Always remember me in your paradise. You understand what I'm saying? My paradise. <laughs> of course, my prince. Oh, this paradise. Very important. Okay, my okay. Not to worry. I remember you, my paradise. But um, that will be tomorrow. Okay. We must have negotiated with her, and then should have brought in larger quantities. Huh? But for now, I'm okay, sorry. my prince. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Hmm. The gods of our land. When a child washes his hand, he dines with the elders. Hmm. Greetings, says Edibia. Welcome. What do you seek? The king wants to see you in the palace. My presence in the palace will not save the calamity that will befall the royal household soon. Tell the king I said so. Okay, Zemo. The child has said the mother will not sleep. He too will not sleep. His presence in the palace cannot stop the calamity that is about to befall 
the royal household. What does he mean by that? Woman, talk to your son. Talk to your son. If you know the best way to talk to him, better do that. Because if anything wrong happens to my throne, by God, I will never forgive him. My king, it has not gotten to this. No. It has gone beyond the limits. It has. Talk to him. Talk to him the best way you can. GK, save us from this calamity. What calamity are you talking about? The one that will befall on us soon if you didn't accept to do what is right. I'll ask you, what other calamity are you talking about? What other calamity is worse than a king who cannot rule as king? What other calamity is worse than a king who will seek the consent of another woman to make a decision in his own land? What other calamity? But that is tradition. Then we're already in a calamity. We live in a calamity. Our tradition is a calamity. So why should I be afraid of any other calamity forthcoming? EGK, if you want me to kneel down, for you to, to do things right, to accept what everyone is telling you, I will do that. Please. Please stop this. Stop it. Please stand up. Then do what everyone wants. Please sit down. Thank you. Um, the prince will be with you shortly. So, sorry, do you care for anything? No, thank you. All right, let me call the prince. My Yes. Uh, the girl is here. Oh, really? Okay, um, tell her I'll be down in a bit. Okay, my Prince. Thank you. Are you running into the bush like a wild animal? I don't blame you. <laughs> you don't have to blame me. Bia, 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 bia. And where is your abroad husband? Or has he left you behind? Well, what else can a low life like you do if not mock those greater than them? And who is greater than who here? You remember those times that your mouth will be running? Eh? Like, I will get married and live her in the village. I will get married and... Auntie, how far? How far? You kind of look familiar. Yeah. I remember seeing you. Yes. Give me my money. Now, come down. I go give you money now. Come give me your money. No, no, this is the superstar you've been telling me. Leave me now. Give me my money. Let me see you. Let me now. You intimidate me. People gather for us. Now they gather. Me they gather. They go gather. Give me my trousers. I never get your money. Once I get the money, I go give you. Sorry. Now what's your name? Give me my money. Give me my money. Give me my money.
Why are you embarrassing me like this now? Two weeks, me. Since they dodged me, I don't catch you today now. You go give my money. I, I will slap you. Slap me now. Ha. Slap me. Give my trouser now. Give me my trouser. Where are you going to leave? Give me your watch. Make a hole. I said, make you watch, make a hole. Hey. I said, make you give me your watch. Make a hole. Hey, 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 hey. What's going on? What's going on? Good day, sir. Good day. Sir. Good day. What's going on? This man here has been owing me since he has refused to pay me. Oh. He has been dodging, you know. To that court scene. All right, okay. I tell him, say, I never get the money. But it's a bitch of my food. All right, can you let the man go, please? No, I will not let him go. Uh, please, stop being aggressive. You're a lady. Let him go. I should stop. Did you hear him say you, you beat me? No, he's not going to do that. He's me. He wants to beat me on top of it. He wouldn't do that. Just no, let no. him go, please. I will not let him go. Let him just give me my give money so I can go. I will not let him go. Hey, can you stop mm. it? You should be a gentleman. Okay. Stop. How much are we talking about here? Two five. Two thousand five hundred naira. Yes. I want to go. Go where? I will not see you again. I want to go. I'm going to have the whole amount. You, you. Can you let the man go now? Well, it's, it's, it's only me to fight. I just want Can my Can you just fight. take this first of all and let the man go? Thank you, sir. You can go. Come on, come. I don't see. You get locked. Oh, Slap me now. It's yours. You get locked. You forgot that here. It's okay. Right? Have a nice day. I'm sorry, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. You were arguing with that man the other day. I mean, come on, that doesn't tell well of you. I know, my friends, and I'm sorry. I don't do that, but you see that Abacha is the only means of my survival since my parents died. And if I don't quarrel with them, they will not pay me. You're an orphan. Yes, my friends. Bless, 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 bless. Okay. Now let's get to the reason you're here. Agali, you have never failed your people. Do not let this that about to happen to happen. This land will never fall on this soil. You have lived our forefathers and will return with success. This time around, you shall lead me to the success and you will never let this happen in this land, Agali. Forefathers, you will lead all of them to success. Agali, do not let this happen to me. Do not let this happen to me because I will not take it. I will not take it. Okay, Uri, Af, Ngwa, I am not the boy, I am the boy, as well. Agali. I will do everything to make sure that this doesn't happen. You will bring your African salad to this palace three times a week. On Monday, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. Thank you, my prince. Are you fine by that? Yes. Good. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. I can go now, right? Oh, yeah. Yes. Thank you, sir. All right. Bye. 
appeared yesterday. What does it mean? Epipe. Always want to know everything. Okay. Uh, it means it's time to crown Prince Ejiki as the crown prince of Ifitani kingdom when our king joins his ancestors. Mm, Papa, can, can he do that without getting married? Yes, our tradition permits that. But he must find a wife on or before 21 days after the coronation. Hey, Papa, where is the coronation taking place? One days. I will pass the information. You may leave. Thank you, Chizo. Can the king bow to a woman? I can roll out to be submissive. I lie as you. I died. I Son, you have to get prepared. In 21 days, you will be affirming the position of your crown prince. Is that what Izimo said? It is a norm. You see, 21 days after the appearance of a blue moon, the heir apparent to the throne is crowned. But your chief said they would not come to this palace again. Um, this event mostly takes place in a market square and not a palace. So they have no reason not to attend. Moreover, the blue moon is a mandate from the gods. It's an express go-ahead to affirm 
the right one on the crown prince. They cannot stop it. <laughs> Funny. So is this the calamity they said will be for me? Oh, this is not a calamity. This one is a blessing. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, can't you see that the gods favor me? They're in support of me because of my decision. How? Oh. Of course, by crowning me, affirming me, the crown prince of this kingdom. Mm, so, do not be in a rush to conclude. Not yet. Well, what I will say is our people's ignorance needs education. I will be the crowned prince and future king. That's <laughs> okay. It is all right. It is done. My father also said Adani had picked the next 21 days to be the day she would pick a man. Huh? <laughs> I thought that is the same day the prince is going to be crowned. Yes. According to my father, he said this such has not happened before. Mm, but why that particular day? According to him, he said Adani had revealed that the gods had decided that it be that day. But you know the good news. All the young men in the village will be coming put those in the abroad and home base and they hope that they get picked mm. where will the ceremony be holding it hasn't been decided yet but trust me now once i find out you'll be the first to hear from me <laughs> okay well, till then uh, where are you taking this to? hey my sister i forgot to tell you good news you're still keeping gist abby <laughs> Can I keep this one? Come and tell me. Come mm -hmm. and tell me. The prince loves my abacha. He has personally instructed that I prepare it and bring it to him in the palace. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> good news. <laughs> Very good news. Mm -hmm. That is not all. The pay. Better money. <laughs> Very good money. Hi. Really? I'm so happy. That is where I'm even going to now. Like right now? Yes. I want to go and give it to him at the palace. Uh, oh, let's go now. You just go home. Why may I go to the palace? I should go home. You want to escort me? Let's go to Why is she always favored? Why is she always lucky to have whatever others admire? Now the prince? No. I can't let her steal this dream of mine. I need to act now. Before they go from business to something deeper. I need to win the prince out. I deserve him. Oh, so who taught you how to make this? My grandmother. Mm. She must have been very renowned for making this, you know? Yes, she was. Um, she was paid to serve people at Bacha in different occasions. Mm. Yes. Nice, 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 nice. I mean, the way you make this, trust me when I say any man who marries you is a lucky person. I mean, I for one would feel very, very elated, you know, having this every day of my life, really. What's your take on that? Can we please talk about something else, my prince? Well, I'm very sorry if that uh, topic made you uncomfortable. So, let me throw the ball at you. What topic do you want to talk about? <laughs> okay, um, you lived abroad, right? Yes. Hans life over there. You mean without a badger? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. What do you eat? Mm -hmm. What we eat? Yes. Every other thing but a badger. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. 
Greetings, my prince. Greetings, beautiful maiden of my community. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, my prince. Good. But what are you doing here? And how did you find this place? Too many questions at a time. Which ones should I attend to? I'm sorry to bother you with my questions. You can start with any. Very well then, I'll start with the question that is very paramount today. My question is, what is today? Wednesday. Wednesday. And Wednesday is the day I have Abacha. So, I have come to take my Abacha. But I always bring it to you at the palace. Well, things have changed. Right now, I want to have the abacha here in your house, possibly from the pot it was made. My love, you have to be patient with me. Help me plead with your father to give us some time. You know, he wants me to go back to base this time with my wife. And with what is happening, he might grow out of patience. And that will make him pressure me into considering other options. Will you? You know I will not. You know I love you a lot. I love you so much. Thank you so much. That's the main reason you should keep me some time. I'll try. Okay. But please, don't make it too difficult for me. I'll try my best. Thanks for your understanding. It's okay. And where are you going? I want to get you a spoon. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, that, I, I don't need that anymore. I thought you said you want to eat. No, uh, actually, if I had come in earlier or if I had met it in the pot. But the time I have right now is for you to sit down and let's talk. Okay, my prince. <sighs> okay. Now, here's my question. Why do you always like to act naive when I talk about a relationship? Because I know my place. You are royalty and should dine with royalty. Well, I hate to hurt your ears when I say no. You're wrong. My mother is not of royalty, but yes, she is the queen of this land. And that should tell you that my father doesn't mind me marrying a non-royal. To surprise you a whole lot more, my father has never been a fan of royalty to royalty relationship or marriage. That's nice of him. But sorry to ask, my prince. Why are you telling me this? Because I like you. I liked you first of all when I met you. And then it ascended by when I went back, you were in my head. After which, again, when I ate your local delicacy, I fell in love with it. And then seeing you again, it ascended to me falling in love with you. My prince, I, I really don't know what to say. It's not about what to say. It's about what you should do.
Greetings, Greetings Adani. Adani. Welcome to my humble abode. Adani, we are pleased to be in your presence. To what do I own this visit? The blue moon has surfaced and gone. The day for the coronation of the prince has been fixed. The same day you have chosen for your ceremony to pick a man. And these two occasions are parallel line that can never meet. Adani, how do we compound these two great occasions? I have resolved with the gods. They shall take place at the same venue. Adani, how? My fear is finally here to hunt me. So this witch has succeeded in making the prince fall for her. This will not happen. This cannot happen over my dead body. Greetings, my princess. Um, please, uh, where is the prince? What is the problem? Why are you looking for him? There is no problem, but there is someone outside that wants to see him. I guess he should be in his room. Okay, thank you, my princess. You're welcome. Greetings, my friends. Greetings. Sit down. So, who are you and what can I do for you? My name is Ebube. Okay. Daughter of Mazio Koli, a distinguished cabinet member. Impressive. So, what can I do for this daughter of a distinguished cabinet member? My prince? Yes. I don't know how you feel about this, but I've decided to summon courage to tell you the honest truth. Okay. I'm listening. I like you. I like you too. You love me? No, I said I like you. Just the same way I like humanity. I never used the word love. Alright? Is there any other thing you want to tell me? Um, my prince. My prince, I love you and... And you have to stop there. <laughs> now listen to me. <laughs> I'm going to be very candid with you. I have somebody I love, okay? So you see, in this heart of mine, there's no space to love another. Love doesn't live here for another person, all right? So please know this. I admire your courage, but get out of that love space. There's no love vacancy where I am. Put up idea. Have a nice day.
Greetings, choosing one. Leave us. Ezedibia, I am underwent by your actions lately. I'm sorry, choosing one. I've been doing my best. And what is keeping the gods from punishing my defaulters? They have refused to act according to my directions. Things are getting out of hand. What is getting out of hand? Everything. I am sorry you may have to use your powers. As I did, that doesn't mean you've lost your authority and position with the gods. Why did the blue moon appear? I saw it coming. I tried to stop it, but it went beyond my control. I see. Ibubi. Hey, Ibubi. Hey, what is it? Destiny killer. Ibubi. Hey, what have I done wrong? Why will you call me a destiny killer? You call yourself my friend. Yet you went ahead to live the only life I've ever dreamt of. I don't understand what you're saying. What do you mean? <laughs> what do I mean? The prince! Marrying the prince and becoming queen of Ifitani. It will be... You never told me you like the prince. I didn't know you admire him. Liar. You call me your best friend. Why did you, why do you have to lie to me? Why don't you just tell me you guys are dating other than using business as an excuse? No, no, no. I, I, honestly, I was going to tell you. Moreover, we, we only spoke about our relationship just yesterday. Chinatu, you lie. I don't want to see you anywhere around me. It will be, be no. If you touch me. Ebube, please leave me and accept her. No, don't say that. No, that's impossible. But she's my best friend. No, can you just stop that? No, don't don't say that. Don't say that. Don't let that be uttered from your mouth. No, your best friend. She doesn't deserve that title. No. If she does deserve that title, she will not fight for what is not hers. Now let me shock you. Do you know that she came to the palace today? Trying to seduce me to love her or make love to her? She did? Of course she did. That's how desperate this person you call your best friend is. And for your own safety, for your own good, stay away from her. Stay miles away from her. Trust me when I say this. You're the one I want. You're the one I've chosen. And that is my stand. And I need you to smile. Come on. Hmm? So, I think it's time you go teach me how to make that your wonderful abacha. Okay? After you come. Let's go. Greetings, my friends. What are you doing here? I am sorry if you're angry about anything. I just... Now, the only reason I'm angry is seeing your face. Like I did ask earlier, what are you doing here? My prince, what have I done? I'll tell you this. Two things. I don't want to ever 
see your face anywhere around this palace. Now the second thing is, if you ever, 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 ever disturb Chinatu, I will make life uncomfortable for you. I, I'm, I'm Get out. My prince, I'm sorry. I said, Get out! Bounce! Wonder she'll never save. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> She wants to marry the prince. Hey. She wants to be the queen of her land. You can imagine. <laughs> she has got to. Hey. Did you My see dear. how dead she is? Did you, did you even see her hair short? <laughs> My dear, you'll be her personal maid when she finally becomes the queen. Yeah. So if you are crazy. <laughs> For us. The mighty and chosen by the gods, Adani. Before we proceed to the coronation of the prince, we shall first attend to her need, which is picking up a man. I call on Adani to make her choice. Are you all right? Wait, did you, did you get drunk before coming here? What, 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 what is... Don't touch me. Don't. What is all this? Huh? Father, father mother, what, what, what insult is this? What was what this? No! I have been disrespected! Um, 
uh, father and mother. Oh, no, no, please, let's do the needful. Uh, say, more, let's do the needful, please. Let's get this coronation done. Why are you wasting time? Or do you want to disobey the blue moon? Do you? Do you want the gods to strike you? Come on, let's do this thing, please. Let's forget about that woman. <clears throat> By the powers conferred on me as the owner of this kingdom. Where is the prince? My dear, why the tears? She has chosen you. But I chose you. Choices don't matter. On the contrary, they do. They do. Listen, on the contrary, hers doesn't, ours do. Okay? I am a man. I am my own man. I've made my choice, and my choice is you. She's a goddess. A living deity. You can say no to her. Well, I've done that before and many times over. This time will not be different. No. My choice is you. I'm scared. Don't. My choice is you. My choice is you. He dare rejects me in public. Please. We are sorry. We don't know what came over him. He has woken the sleeping lioness. And I shall inflict unforgettable misery on this land. If in three days he doesn't think. Biko, Emenekera, Biko. Please, we will make sure he has a rethink. We will persuade him, Biko. Yes, please. Three days. If it turn, it will be too hot to accommodate any living thing. Adan, please, do not unleash your wrath upon us. Please forgive. Put on him, at least for the sake of the unborn generation. Please. Oh no. Then do the needful. Three days. Three days. Three. Ezedibia, this is so difficult to ask, for you know what this means to me. It means doom. It simply means the end of rain, of my lineage. You cannot go against the tradition you have been choosing to protect your highness. Ms. Olivia, you are correct. But is there no remedy? Is there nothing that can be done to avert this and make the plague Go away? I mean, is there no, no, no Enough, your highness. Mind your words before you incur the wrath of the gods. Adani's choice is not a curse, but a blessing. Whichever family she chooses, enjoys. 
is a DBR. A blessing to one person can mean a curse to the other. Now tell me, losing a kingdom, the throne that was handed over to me by my forefathers, is it a curse or a blessing? He has been chosen and he must answer. Adani has given three days. Yes. <laughs> the face of this your soup is looking very nice. <laughs> Thank you, Papa. Mm -hmm. um, well, Papa, mm -hmm. why is even the king frowning at Adani's choice? <clears throat> because uh, because he will lose his hair and the throne of Ifitani will leave the royal lineage. The prince will die. No, 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 that's not what I mean. What happened is that anybody that marries Adan will leave his father's house, will go and stay with her. And that person will lose all his traditional rights, his father's wealth, the throne, everything. So you can understand why the king is not happy. Wow. So if the prince marries Adan, he will have no other heir. I'm happy about this. Hey, baby. Papa. Is you happy about you? No, not. I'm sad. Hey, baby. Papa. Hey, baby. Papa. Oh, Papa. Always asking questions about royal family. Be careful. Look, come down here. You make me talk, 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 even when I'm eating. I have been complaining. I have been lamenting. I've been raising my voice because of the excess powers given to that woman, given to that idiot. Now, have we seen what has happened? Are our eyes open now. Huh? Father. Listen, we are the royal family. Change must start with us. Things must change. Father, you have to take a stand. Father. Father, talk. You see? You see? The king has nothing to say, but I will talk. I will never, never, ever, ever get married to that idiot of a woman. I won't. She's been threatening the entire kingdom. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care! house is on fire, does not hunt for a rat. So, what's your resolution? What do you intend to do? My hands are tied. I am 
caught in between. I cannot fight a tradition I am protecting. So, what you're saying in essence is that you will allow the prince marry Adani and leave the palace? My queen, whatever decision he takes is fine. And I will do as much as I can to stay away and not influence his decision. Yes. My prince, you need to save this kingdom. I will leave you for nobody. I don't want to be the reason this kingdom will suffer. You won't. We can pull this through. We can win this together. I am weak. I don't have the strength to fight this battle. Then let me be your strength. I will be strong for us. Like I said, we can pull this through. I'm scared. Don't be. I'll protect you. Fate and love will protect us. Don't be scared. <clears throat> Adani, please make another choice. He's the heir to the throne. I have no other son. No one else to reign after me, please. My happiness first, before the throne. I have never disputed that. But my ancestors will be highly disappointed at me if I should lose the throne handed over to me, if I should allow it slip off my fingers. Please. The prince is my choice. And there is no going back. I must have him. <clears throat> okay. But please, can you, can you please extend your grace? If Itani has just two days, else they will test what they have not seen before. This kingdom will perish if you don't change your decisions. Then let it perish. Let the kingdom perish. Let everybody go down to ashes. That way everybody will be wise. Okay, everybody will now be wise to seek the change that needs to be sorted. Yes, let it perish. Let all of us perish. You can't tell how brutal this might be. Save us. Save this kingdom. What should actually be the plea is that the kingdom should save itself from injustice. That's what you should be talking about. And everybody should be talking about that. Are you not afraid of death? For man is destined to die but once. Is it, Dibia? Is there nothing you can do? There is nothing anyone can do. You can convince Adani to give us more time. Only the heedless fly accompanies the cops to the grave. Go and convince the prince. That will be difficult. Very, very difficult. Here's a Dibia. You know how stubborn that boy can be. How do I convince him? Oh no. 
I'll tell you categorically, convincing the press will be much more easier than getting Adani to change her mind. She swallowed the first humiliation method on her by the prince. She can never take it again. Never. Hey. The land of Ifitani is doomed. <clears throat> doomed. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm there is chaos in our land. We are about to witness tragedy. Hmm. I pray it doesn't come with death. That is what I fear most too. Not for myself, but for the life of our younger ones. What have we done to deserve this? This is the same question I ask the gods every day. That's the same question. Now, I begin to wonder. If Adani actually is a blessing or a cost to Ifitani. Shakwa. May the gods forbid. Ichamade. How dare you such utter such an abomination? How dare you, my compound? If you will say ever say such a thing, you better leave. I, I'm, I'm sorry, but uh, I, I, it doesn't I don't want you to say such a thing again. What are you talking about? An elder like you. Who's supposed not to say such a thing? Don't you know what I've done stand for? How dare you? I think you better, you better start living before you, you, you say something that will, that will contaminate my compound. Uh, so are you driving me away? You better about? leave. You better leave. How can you say such a thing? So what do I am? You find good time on the You can marry now, Wolfie. You don't know what you're supposed to do. You cannot control your tongue. Can you imagine? Everything has fallen apart. The land is under the sea. I think it be no joy. Boy, oh, I'm going to get a
submissive. I as Submissive, I lie as you. 
Awake! I'm choosing war. Please, please don't hurt me. Don't hurt me, please. I'm only an orphan. Please, I beg you. Do not be scared. Do not sleep on your destiny. Chinatu, daughter of Okuma. You know me. Even my father. Your existence is a mystery to humor. Dream of immortal. You are favored. What are you saying? Come with me. My name is Ijele. Call me Ijele. Come. You have not answered all my questions. Because I do not have the answers to your questions. You are a spiritualist. If you can't answer them, who can? Annie is the only one that can answer your questions. Who is Annie? Your ancestral father. But he is dead. Does it mean my questions will not be answered? You can still communicate with him. Those who claim to speak with him have not heard his voice even for a day. I will be back. When I return, a process shall begin. Ejike, we just have today. We don't know what tomorrow holds. Oh, please just tell me about something. Look, I'm currently bothered about my girl. I went to her place and she wasn't there. After tomorrow, this kingdom might cease to exist. That should be your major worry. Do I look like I care about this kingdom right now? Do I look so? No, look at my look at my face. Look at my demeanor. Do I look like I care about this kingdom right now? I care about my woman. I care about her whereabouts. In her, I see the future. There is no future. If all of us should die, there's nothing like future. Please save us! You know one thing about you, my family members, all of you are a whole bunch of selfish lots. You're all selfish. You don't care about me or my well-being. You care about yourselves. You care about the reason you're going to live tomorrow. Not about my well-being, not about my placement in life. And you feel that well-being, also your living tomorrow hangs on me. 
will hear my news today. All of you better prepare for the afterlife because I will never, 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 never marry Adani. made him blind. Who are they? Tomorrow, if it's turning, we test Jarrod. Can anything be done to avert this evil? Tomorrow, that which found things the evil shall be revealed. You, you, you're getting me confused. I do not have the answer to your questions. Who then? Adani. In my community?
Hey! What is happening? Is this the calamity Adan he talked about? Hey! No! My wife! My daughter! My, my family! My wife! Of course, change is one constant thing they must adhere to in this land. Of course, I'm here. I'm here. Have you seen it? I'll call you back. I'll call you back. What are you talking about? Hey, GK, have you seen what you've caused? Like I said, what are you talking about? The anger of the gods has befallen in Vitani because of your stubbornness. And since when did you start barging into my room? My next question is when did you start talking to me in that manner? Huh? Now, can you relax and tell me what you're really talking about? on my son. Nico, please. I have spoken to him. He'll be here soon. He will marry you, please. No! I warned you. I warned you never to incur my wrath, but you have met your end. Who are you? Tina Atu, daughter of Okuma and the descent of Annie. You lie! You know the truth. You know you are not the Adan. Your family conspired with the chief priest to rip me off my position. You went as far as acquiring powers from the Dwarf of Mubara Hills to protect your position and blindfold the gods. Your family went ahead to will more powers to the position of Adan thereby making the royal family secondary as against the directive of the gods. This is blasphemy and I will have you pay for it. If I were you, I would give up. As the DPR is dead. And they will go down with you if you don't give up. No! No! I am not going to allow you to take my position. Never! I will not... Adani, Adani falls! Adani falls! 
as she's standing. Adani was never meant to be a leader, but a spiritual protector to the king. The primary duty of Adani is to protect the king and this land. I apologize to all those who have lost their loved ones. Sometimes sacrifices must be made to achieve success. Today, if Itani will return to normal. Isha. Oh, that's from a woman. Like, yes, you. 